What's up everybody? I'm Tyreek Wynn and this is Tyreek on the Move. Everybody and welcome to a special edition of Tyreek on the Move. I'm your host Tyreek Wynn and happy St. Patrick's Day. Yes, we are here at broadcasting here in Miami, Florida, which is about about 10 hours from Atlanta. So uh, we decided to branch out and do something a little bit different. Um, we've never broadcasted um, the entire show uh, from another state. So we decided to do, the, to do that today. So, um, you know, the biggest thing, the biggest thing in news, this virus, the coronavirus, COVID-19, man, it's, uh, it's, it's something pretty big. It's, it's something huge. So you take a look behind me, just some of the effects that people are feeling. Take a look behind me. All of the cruise ships um, that many of you may have sailed on. I had my fair pleasure of sailing on a few of these ships myself are all docked here in Miami, Florida. Well, not all of the ships, but most of them are docked here in Miami. Um, cruise ships are not operating right now. Um, lots of them won't operate until probably the end of March, which is the end of this month. Um, my school, Georgia State University, canceled all classes for the remaining of the semester. Uh, the classes will now be online, so I'm going to be spending a lot of time at home completing school work. Um, actually, we actually had a chance that we drove by um, the cruise ports over there, and it seemed like there were people just arriving um, who were just getting off the ship who may have been stuck on the ship for a few days, um, you know, going through some struggles and things of that nature. So we had a chance to go over there. But the main thing is, do you know the facts of the coronavirus? And that's the main thing. Lots of people don't know the facts, uh, the, the facts behind this thing and <clears throat> just uh, lots of information about it. Symptoms. Lots of people think that they may not have the virus because they're not experiencing symptoms. Well, turns out you still may have the virus even if you're not experiencing symptoms. They say, well, this is what it is said, that if you have the virus, you want to experience symptoms to between two days to 14 days out of being exposed to the virus. But some say that you may not even have symptoms, but you may still have the virus. So it's something key that you have to pay attention to. Right now, what the country is working on doing is having different testing stations throughout the country so people can get tested. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> um, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I just realized what I did. I do not have the virus, I promise you. I do not have it. Anyways. <laughs> um, but yeah, so knowing the facts, um, fever, coughing, shortness of breath, few key symptoms of the coronavirus. If you have any of those symptoms, you want to get tested immediately, right away. You don't want to waste any time. You want to go ahead and get tested right now, right this second. Also, on top of that, quarantine yourself. Whether you have to do a self-quarantine or somebody else is quarantining you, self-quarantine yourself. Um, social distancing. Um, I think the president just announced no gatherings of 10 plus people around you. Um, I can't lie, I haven't, I haven't been there, um, I haven't done that. You know, I've been having fun in the city. I'm on vacation, I'm on spring break. I'm having fun. But I am taking very safety precautions as, you know, to what I'm doing out here in Miami. So I, I be having my gloves on, I be, um, you know, doing, you know, taking special measures and precautions and things like that. So yeah, um, definitely, you know, wear your gloves, keep your hand sanitizer on you wash your hands people i didn't know that it had to be this big pandemic for people to be clean and wash their hands wash your hands bathe 
shower, keep hand sanitizer on you at all times, you know, the hand sanitizer, you know, it's not, the hand sanitizer is not for replacing hand washing, but it is for that time when you can't get to the actual sink to wash your hands. So make sure you wash your hands, stay clean, and you can keep the virus away from you. If you're experiencing symptoms, get tested right away. Don't wait any longer. Make sure everybody in your household is getting tested. If you have been tested, don't expose yourself to people. And stay safe. Once again, wash your hands and be clean. We're here in Miami, Florida. I'm Tyreek Wayne, and this is Tyreek on the Move.